This tutorial will show you how to use text-to-speech software to create a voiceover for your online presentation. The first thing you should do is create a script. To make it easier to import later, you may want to break it up by slide. Slide notes can be used when recording voiceovers and can also help you see which slides get which text. To convert your text-to-speech, use from texttospeech.com. This website is a fast and simple way to convert text to a downloadable MP3 file. For this example, we'll convert a single phrase, but the same principle works for even long complex presentations. First, paste the text here in this box. These drop down menus let you choose a language, a voice, and a speed for the audio. When you're ready, click Create Audio File. The text will now be processed. When the process is complete, you can preview the audio in the mini player. To download the file, right click Download Audio File and select the Save As option. Find a folder on your computer and click Save. Now, back here in PowerPoint, click Manage Narration on the iSpring toolbar to import the audio. Click the Audio button and find the file. An Import Audio dialog will pop up. Here you can select where to insert the clip and whether or not to adjust the slide duration to fit the clip. Note that if you've generated separate clips for each slide, all slides will be adjusted to fit them. If you have one clip for the whole presentation, leave this box unchecked, but remember that you will have to adjust the slides yourself. Now click Insert. The clip can now be seen on the timeline. Note how easy it is to adjust slide durations to match the timing of the narration. Plus, you can always preview the result by clicking the play button, or see it with all animations intact by clicking Preview with Animations. When you're done, click Save and Close. Did you like this video? Give it a like and subscribe to the iSpring YouTube channel for more updates.